Yes now guys, it's your boy the Gaming Dude and today we are Gaming Dudes, we are back with Super Liminal. I haven't played in several days, but I've been thinking about this game heavy, so let's get into it. Am I getting more alarm clocks every day? Did I have? Because I came back to my room several times at this point, so I haven't really checked it. Let's just fucking get into it. Whoosh. Here we go. Whoosh. Here we go. Whoosh. Get another one. In here. Boom. What are we doing? Move that shit. I need that. Oh, no. That's bolted down. Boom, boom, boom. That's bolted down. I'm just gonna get the door from back here then. That's so cool. Attention, Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following risks of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss, both quantitative and qualitative. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects. Unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways. And other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. smiley face. I didn't realize that. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Right click to return. Right click. Doesn't do anything. An apple for a head. Artery. 
got some more. Yeah, tell me I won't. Don't give me my apples. Clawing <gasps> an object way too many times. Look at it. Look at that. Okay, we can. Nice. Okay, I don't know what the color that was. Oh, uh, damn it. I'm trying to get it up here, but it's not working. Nice! <laughs> oh, I could have just... Been pulling fire alarms. Alright, back to speedrunning. Warning. Dr. Pierce is frantically submitting numerous spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. I have no subroutine to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. Attention, Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello, my introductions are redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help you, but I also do not know how. Transmission ends. Hello, name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. To the Somnusculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader, patient years 10 development. Back to the bed. And we go back to the bed. Then we just leave the room. I'm not even dealing with it. Too many alarms. Ah, the only one though. The door across the relaxation room. Don't mind if I do. Wow. 
Is this Martin Luther, Martin Luther King Jr.? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. This is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Please continue to do whatever you did most recently and discontinue whatever you were doing immediately prior to that. I'm inside the room. <laughs> Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In addition to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. Little bitty. I was supposed to be a little bitty. Let's go. Anybody 
show. Wow. Wow. Hold up. What if I up here? Hmm? Then what are you gonna do if I like? Oh wait. They're not the same. I was lied to. Bamboozled. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to read you my favorite inspirational quote by me. The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. Let's go. <laughs> Huge. Super. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, okay, Glenn. and I'd like to thank you for triggering every single one of our 823 emergency protocols. You're okay. Now that he's done yapping. Oh wait, does this work? <laughs> 